Hi guys and welcome back to another video and to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. So in today's video we are going to look at Instagram Reel transitions and how to do them quick and easy. And this is probably one of the most requested videos in my Instagram DMs. You guys really wanted to know how I do these transitions and if I can teach you how to do them. These transitions are going to spice up your Instagram Reels as well as they are so super fun to do so here are three transitions that you need to incorporate in your instagram reels okay so probably the first thing that i can give you guys is to use a tripod for your phone so you can get these tripods at one day only like a lot um online shops like Instagram online shops sell these tripods. I would definitely say invest in a tripod that can hold your phone because some of these transitions really require your phone to be stationary in a spot. So I'm not going to use sound on my Instagram reels just for the reason that I do not want to get copyrighted on my YouTube channels. Okay, so I'm currently screen recording. So you're gonna go into the little timer down at the bottom and there you can like select how many seconds you want to do your little thing before you go into the transition and then you can also change the music at the top left right the speed as well as you can add effects so here is some Instagram filter effects or you can just put a little touch up so that's just gonna you know clean up your face a little bit and then like i said the timer is down below so what i'm gonna do for the first transition is actually something quite easy to do that is just basically taking your hand and going towards the screen it's probably one of the most used transitions but it's such a cool transition because you can really play around with it it's very controllable and super super easy to do okay so let me show you guys what i'm going to do so i'm going to let's do four seconds and i'm going to press the little reels button and it's going to count down three two one so i'm just going to pose and one two three and that is it then what you want to do is go to the little arrow in the corner and what i'm going to do is i'm going to change into another shirt so then it's going to look like i changed outfits um you can do this as like a makeup transformation um location transformation so let me quickly change into another outfit so i just quickly change into this sweater to have that exact like smooth transition you will see on the left side below the timer so there's two squares and that is the align so there you will kind of see where the reel stopped so there you're gonna have that super super smooth transition without it looking jumpy or you know just weird and out of place okay so i set the timer i'm going to align my hand three two Let's quickly see what it looks like. So now you can go to preview. One, two. Okay, so it doesn't look too bad. So I'm going to go back with the arrow in the corner. And I'm going to go to my first clip. And these little scissors. I'm going to basically cut a little bit of the front of the video. So now we will see it's going to basically cut on action. So let's preview that again. And one. And there you have it, a super, super seamless transition. On to the second transition, and that is actually the snapping transition, which is also so easy to do. Um, so you can either snap in front of the camera like that. You can snap next to your face or to your body. Again, you're going to go to the timer down below. Four seconds. And then I'm just going to change into another shirt. So let's quickly do that. Then we're going to count down. Let me three, two, one. Go to the scissors. One, two. And the moment my finger kind of does that, there, that movement over there. I'm going to kind of crop it over there. So let me just quickly change into another shirt. And I just quickly change into another outfit. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to align my fingers with 
the previous video. So I'm just gonna try and align that. And then you can click the timer button down below. It's gonna count down. Click and pose and pose and do whatever you want. Okay, let's quickly have a look at that. It's kind of jumpy. So let's go back. We're gonna go back and cut the front of it. That moment where my finger snaps. And let's see what it looks like. There we go. That is actually a really nice way, again, to change outfits, to change your makeup, to change locations. So let's quickly move on to the last transition. Okay, and now for the last and third transition, and it's called the spinning transition and it's quite quite popular on TikTok as well as um, you know Instagram reels so what you're gonna do is again go into your reels touch up do your timer select your audio let's say six seconds so I just quickly put my mic on the tripod because I don't want to like rip it out of my camera so basically what you're going to do is sing with the music or whatever and then you're going to spin and in that spinning, you're going to change your outfit, change your makeup, change your hair, change your whatever. Um, so let me show you how you do that. Um, and then you're going to count down. Three, two, one. Going to do whatever you want, whatever you want. And then just spin. Okay. Um, so I sp sp spin or whatever you can call it. And then you're going to change into another outfit. So let me quickly do that. I'm going to go back with the arrow and you're going to cut wherever you feel like you want to join the transition. So I'm going to join it over here because it's just, just in the middle and the movement is quite blurry. So it's going to look super, super smooth. So set timer and then we are going to count down and turn. Quickly edit that together. Okay, let's quickly see what that looks like. One, two, three, turn. Okay. So you can incorporate all of these transitions in no matter what your niche is. So not only is this super, super quick and easy to do, but really going to spice up your Instagram reels. And hopefully this video helped you on where to cut and chop and change your transitions. And you guys saw how quick and easy actually this was. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked this video and you found it helpful, please do not forget to give me a big thumbs up as well as subscribe down below if you want to see more like content creating tips and tricks as well as I do makeup as well. And that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Mwah.